Tom Ellis is on to make his 100th first team appearance. Came all the way through the Bath Academy. Yeah, I'm really proud to have actually actually got there. Uh, as you say, like it is a milestone, and I think a few years ago when I hit 50, I was very much like, right, I fully like this doesn't feel like a milestone. I think 100 is really where you want to get to, and um, so yeah, I'm really I'm really proud to have got there. Um, clearly, wouldn't have got there without a lot of help and support from friends and family along the way. A bit strange going into a game with people saying like, congratulations, and the game hasn't even started yet. <laughs> like. Um, to reach 100 games for my boyhood club is, you know, something really special and something I'll always be very happy to have done. Through getting to 100 games, since everyone clearly goes from debut, but there's a huge amount of work that you know goes before there to get to debut. And when you get debut, you can't even imagine getting to 100. You're just buzzing to get on the pitch. Um, so yeah, it's been a hell of a process. And as you say, like from coaches at Millfield to coaches. Um, through the academy, I had a couple of academy um, directors as I was, as I was coming through, um, and I think in those, like, from all of those um, coaches, they ma managed to instill quite a lot of resilience in our group coming through. Um, you know, in my career, I've so far I've had some decent highs and some decent lows, um, mainly through injury, um, and you know. Very thankful to the club for you know, I don't know, keeping the faith, uh, looking after me through those times. Um, but yeah. Chudley and the try will be scored by Ellis. So much energy and the quickest of bath responses. Tom Ellis with the try. My clearly my debut stands out. Glasgow Warriors away. It was a Champions Cup. We had an injury crisis, and I think me and Charlie you always came off the bench in that, which was. Clearly, no one would have ever seen that coming at the beginning of the year, two second year academy kids. My first Prem start was alongside Hoops in the second row. Clearly beating Sale away last year uh, in, during restart. There have been some big performances throughout, throughout the time, my time at the club or my time getting to 100. There's been some big names throughout my, throughout my time so far at the club and they've, you know, they've, um, they've always been very good with younger guys coming through and are now you know, now I'm in a position of 100 games, I want to be, you know, looking to the likes of Ewan, Ethan, uh, those guys coming through and, you know, giving them a helping hand as well. Quite enjoy my coaching um, and I think, you know, that's all part of it and the times where I enjoy coaching the most are when, you know, people are receptive and people want to get better and you're of course going to get that from guys. Um, in this environment, so I do enjoy helping them, and I, you know, you look back at, I, I look back at what in my first few years at the club, and you know, the the likes of Hoops, the likes of Dave Atwood, massively helped me and Charlie as we were both you know, second rows at the time coming through, and just those little things and those little snippets of information just that they can give, I really appreciate it. So to be able to do that, I think is, you know, I think is important. It was very surreal after the game. Is like. Going and seeing uh, Bella, I haven't seen her, like clearly ever seen her after directly after a game before, so it was quite cool to you know to go and do that. You know, and again, thanks to the club for allowing them to them to both be there because you know it's you know once in a once in a lifetime opportunity to have them both there really on a hundredth game.